everybody, it's Jerry, and one of my favorite dishes growing up was turkey tetrazzini. So I decided to make some jackfruit tetrazzini, and uh, it really takes me back. So let me show you how to do it. So we're going to start out by taking one can of jackfruit, which has been washed and drained, and just cutting it into bite-sized pieces throwing it in a pot of water which is being cooked over medium heat for about 30 minutes. Meanwhile we're going to take a half a cup of cashews which have been soaked overnight with a half a cup of water in a food processor and just grind everything together until it's nice and smooth. Uh, you could also use a blender for this. So we're basically making some cashew cream. And just set that aside. And then we're going to take a skillet over medium heat and melt one tablespoon of vegan butter. Add about three cloves of garlic, just cook it for about a minute. And add eight ounces of mushrooms, which, which have been chopped. And a quarter cup of white wine. And just cook everything together for about five minutes. Then we're going to add another two tablespoons of vegan butter and just melt that in. And then we're going to add two tablespoons of brown rice flour. And one cup of vegetable broth. Mix that all together, just let it cook for a minute. And then we're going to add in our cashew cream. And then we'll add in our jackfruit, which has been drained. Mix that all together. And then we're gonna salt and pepper to taste. You can add more salt later if you, you find that it needs more salt. Just let that cook for a few minutes. And then we're going to add a half a cup of frozen peas, a half a cup of vegan shredded cheddar cheese, and one teaspoon of oregano, dried oregano. Mix that together, and at this point we can turn the heat off. And while all this is going on, we're gonna be cooking eight ounces, one eight ounce package of gluten-free spaghetti, just according to package directions. And you want it kind of al dente, you don't wanna cook it too long. And just mix that in with everything until everything is nicely combined. And then we're gonna turn everything into a eight by eight inch baking dish. And then we're gonna take a quarter cup of grated vegan Parmesan cheese and a half a cup of breadcrumbs and mix them together, gluten-free breadcrumbs, of course. And then we're gonna add one tablespoon of oil Mix that all together. And then just spoon that on top of the spaghetti mixture. And then we're going to bake it at 375 degrees for around 30 minutes or until nicely browned and it's ready to serve.
Thanks everybody for watching and please like and subscribe and let me know if there are recipes you'd like to see on the channel and I'll see you next time.